good night. Thanks, Danny. Well, the race is still on, and the Republicans are having quite a celebration tonight. Even though the official results are still on the way, the polls are announcing a strong lead, which most likely means a Republican-controlled Senate. It was all pride and joy at the West and South Coast Plaza Hotel, where the candidates were first received in the small area in which they anticipated the upcoming results. The festivities let all the Republicans move to a grand ballroom, where the party would soon begin. After an initial prayer, everyone emotionally recited the pledge and solemnly sang the national anthem. Scott Baugh, chairman of the Republican Party of Orange County, presented the results of the polls and stats. Action which steered a room filled with cheer and applause. The political strategy implemented for these elections was a little different from past years. Well, in a, in, here in California statewide, we knew that our opponents were mainly incumbents and they had more money than we did. So we had to make an extra effort to use what's called earned media, meaning we visited with newspaper editorial boards, talk radio, and in-person contact all around the state. Meant a lot of time traveling the state, not just buying television commercials. The rise of the Republican Party had all the presidents excited, and the candidates ensured that their commitment would produce change and improvement. Well, you know, I want to make sure that we protect Prop 13. I want to make sure that all children are safe and that they all have access to quality education and colleges as well. Today, the people's voice was heard all over the country. Now, their political future depends on those results. Reporting from Costa Mesa for Around and About Orange County News, I'm Claudia Buccio.